business of the year is um, you know, quite an honor. I mean, when you wait to all the other companies that have been in business for years and years around the Power Valley, it's, uh, it's quite an honor because um, obviously your peers are selecting you to, you know, as, the, as the business of the year. So they must see something in us that, they, that they, they like. If we go back and we think about, you know, when we started it, our whole concept there was that we were losing the whole character of the restaurants of Watsonville. There was always a get-together place. Back when I was a kid, it was the Miramar. You know, there's Del Monte, there was Lorraine's Packing Shed. There was, you know, there was a lot of great restaurants and you would go in there on a weekend and you would pretty much know everybody in the place. It was kind of like a community gathering place. And so you would walk through the restaurant and you know, you know half to three quarters of the people. And if you didn't, a lot of times you'd introduce yourself to whoever was there because they were part of the community too. And so I, I experienced that as a kid and growing up and I kind of, saw that slipping away you know so we created this concept and if you go into the California Grill and you look on the wall it says perpetuating Par Valley Pride and our whole theme with that is that you know that we want to instill the pride that everybody deserves in this in the Par Valley and so so that's what you know our whole concept was is to recreate that and so I think you know people are, gather, are gathering on now that we're that we're um, buying local products, you know, we grow a lot, all the vegetables ourselves, and we're buying local meats, local breads, and you know, and so, and so that's kind of the whole the whole concept of the restaurant. That's where we, you know, where we wanted to go, and it's definitely headed that direction right now. So, growing up with my dad as a farmer, you know, sitting in the pickup truck eating peas off the vine, and that it, it tastes the best that way, and so I love fresh food. And I love the idea that it came from 10 minutes away from, you know, and, and it's, uh, you know, going to Nita Gizditch's ranch and picking up fresh pie. You can smell that pie being baked when you get to the pie shop, you know. You know it's not been frozen and it hasn't been from this manufacturer or anything and it's just fresh. It comes natural to us to serve our family and so, and, and it's just, how it is and that's I don't think it should be any other way than family serving family and you know and the food should just be like your grandmother's you know it should be that top-notch food by treating our employees like family our employees treat our customers like family and so that's kind of the full circle family and family and family is that what that's what makes the restaurant such a great place is the community and the family so you know the, the thank yous really go out to we got to start with the community as a whole I mean um, they've been fantastic supporting us um, you know when we um, have our cancer fundraiser every year um, people just come in and say you know some people come in three times during that day just to support us um, you don't get that in the big community but in our community it just hits home to me that the people come out and support us like that you know our employees have been fantastic. You know, we've instilled in them that it's, you know, that it's very important that they enjoy their work. You know, that people know if they walk in, they know if you're fake, they know if you're real. And so when they walk in and they get greeted at the door um, and then right all the way through the whole dining experience, it's really important that that they know that you're, you are for real and that you're there to serve them. And so, and then all the way down to the kitchen, I've seen the kitchen put up a plate and pull the plate back because it, it, the, it just didn't look right on the plate to pull the plate back. No, I'm gonna fix that. I'm not gonna send out a plate that's you know, got some, you know, got a mess on the side or something like that. So we wanna have the proper per, people's perception of it. And so we're gonna take pride in our work. And so that's one thing we really push and take pride in whatever you do, you know? So um, we own several businesses, the California Girl being one of those. And, and the whole concept is to, you know, to take pride in what you do, follow through with that. On behalf of my family and the California Grill, I am very proud and we are all honored to be your business of the year. And we invite you to come and taste the bounty that is the Pajaro Valley.